Welcome to the Beeline Reader Browser plugin. In this quick video, we'll show you how to use Beeline to read ebooks, news articles, and word processing documents. We'll also show you the advanced features of our browser plugin, and if you have any further questions, you can always email us. To access the Beeline settings, click the blue B icon in the upper right hand corner. In the settings, you can change between various color presets or you can create a custom color scheme with the colors that you like best. After you find a color scheme that you like, the next step is to set your auto run preference. The Beeline browser plugin will automatically run on pages, but you can decide if you want it to only run on long form pages with lots of text, or if you also want it to run on pages that have very little text. If you only want it to run on long form pages, move the slider all the way to the left. If you want it to run on any page, then move it to the right. And if there's a site where Beeline is running and you don't ever want it to run, select the Never Color This Site option and it will never auto run on that page. If you only want to use Beeline on a handful of sites, then you can use what's called a whitelist option, where you add certain sites to a whitelist and the Beeline plugin will only run on those pages. To do this, right click on the blue icon and select Manage Extensions. Scroll down to where it says Site Access, and instead of selecting On All Sites, select On Specific Sites. Then just add each site that you're interested in, putting an asterisk and a period before the website, in this case, star.wikipedia.org. Then the Beeline Browser plugin will run on Wikipedia, but it won't run on any other websites. You can add as many sites as you want to this whitelist, and Beeline will only run on those pages. Going back to the Beeline settings, here you can access features like focus mode, which helps you focus on the text of a website by obscuring banners and other distracting elements. We also let you change the font size, as well as adjust the line height and even the letter spacing along a line to make text easier to read. One of the most popular uses of the Beeline browser plugin is to read ebooks from Amazon Kindle or from Overdrive. You can do this by going to read.amazon.com where you can access your Kindle library, including books that you've rented from a library through Overdrive and you've delivered to your Kindle Cloud library. When you go to the Kindle Cloud library at read.amazon.com, it will show you all of the books that are available to you, and when you click on any of them, they'll open up and will automatically be colored by the Beeline browser plugin. Another popular use of Beeline is to read news articles, which you can either do on news websites or through news aggregators like Pocket, which allow you to save news articles and read them later. These sites offer a really clean, crisp reading experience and even offer a night mode that makes it really great to read in the evenings before going to bed. Lastly, many people want to read word processing documents with Beeline, and there are a couple of ways to do that. One is to print the document to PDF and use our PDF plugin. Another is to upload a document to Google Docs, or if it's already in Google Docs, you can access it there using our browser plugin. Just open up the document in Google Docs and Beeline will color it as usual. If you enjoy using Beeline to read books in the Kindle Cloud Reader on sites like Pocket or in Google Docs, please consider sending a feature request to these sites using the links in the description below. It's easy for a platform to integrate Beeline and when they do, then you can access the Beeline functionality from any device, not just your home computer that has our browser plugin installed. If you have any questions about the Beeline browser plugin or any of our other tools, you can always email us at contact at beelinereader.com.